When you're working with the Dream Draper drawing tools, the default settings are that shapes draw generally with a gray fill and a black outline, such as the rectangle that I'm going to draw right here. There. The lines draw at a specified color and width, and the default text is the Arial font with a font size of 36. But you can change all of these settings to your own preferences, such that every time you open up the Dream Draper program, your preferences are the default. For example, I changed the preference for drawing the circle, such that now if I draw a circle, it's going to draw with a blue fill. You can do these preference changes to any of the drawing tools. To change the preference on the rectangle, I can go up to Edit and Preferences. Then I will have a drop-down box here, and I'm going to go down to the rectangle. And you see the default value right now is it will draw with a gray fill and a black outline. But in this case, if I want to change it, I'll just double-click on the fill color box. And I'm going to select the same pale blue color as the circle. So I'll press OK. There. Now up here you can see that the new color in the color box is that pale blue. If I wanted to, I could change the width of the outline. That's the stroke width. And I can change the stroke color. Right now it's a black outline. For this example, I'm going to remove the outline and then I'll click on the Save button. So if I draw my rectangle again, it will be a blue fill with no outline. There! So the next time you open the Dream Draper program, the program will remember your own preferences. You can explore the various preference features for each of the items. For example, if you want to change the preferences for your text, you can choose the stroke width, that's the outline of the text. You can change the fill color of the text and the outline or stroke color. So your text can have a fill color and an outline color. You can also change the default font size and also the font itself. When you've made your selection, just click on Save All and that will save your own preferences. If you ever want to revert back to the program defaults, you can just click on the default button for that item. In this case, if you clicked on Default, it would go back to the system default for your text. If you clicked on Restore All Defaults, it will restore the defaults for all of the items. Those are all the drawing tools plus the text. There's one other feature I'd like to show you, and that is in regards to the Dimension Tool. If you will notice, you also can change the stroke width of the Dimension Tool, plus the color and the stroke color, but you also can change the units. Right now, the default value is that the Dimension Tool measures in inches but you can change that to metric if you want. If you change the dimension tool to metric, when you draw it, it will draw in centimeters. And also, when you go to resize an object using object scale, the dimensions will be shown in centimeters as well. So just remember that you can save your preferences
And if you ever want to revert to the default value for that drawing tool, just click on the default button here. And if you want to revert back to all the standard defaults for all of the drawing tools, just click on Restore All Defaults. You will love the Preferences feature.